Good morning. I'm Batna Priya, Assistant Professor in Department of CSE, RMD Engineering College. Today, I'm going to take the topic, Fast Retransmit or Fast Recovery under the subject, CS8601 Mobile Computing. Fast Retransmit or Fast Recovery. It is one of the TCP congestion control mechanism. Here, the sender will be sending one packet to the receiver. Before the timer expires, the receiver has to send the acknowledgement to the sender. The sender can retransmit the missing packet before the timer expires. It does not wait until the timer expires. It retransmits a packet whenever sender is getting three duplicate acknowledgements. After retransmitting a packet, it sets the window size reduced to its half. Now, seeing this diagram, you can understand more clearly. Initially, the sender is sending one packet to the receiver and the receiver is sending the acknowledgement for it. The sender is sending the next packet, packet 2. Unfortunately, this packet has been lost and the receiver did not get sent any acknowledgement for it because it did not receive the data. Now, the sender is sending the next packet, packet 3. The receiver is expecting packet 2 and it is receiving packet 3. So, the previous acknowledgement which was being sent was acknowledgement 1. And now, the receiver on receipt of packet 3 is going to send acknowledgement 1 again. So, this is going to be named as duplicate acknowledgement 1. Now, the sender is going to transmit packet 4 to the receiver. Now, again, receiver is expecting packet 2, but packet 4 has come. So, it is sending duplicate acknowledgement 1. Sender is sending fifth packet. Again, receiver was expecting packet 2, but it got packet 5. Now, this packet receiver is going to send duplicate acknowledgement 1. Now, the receiver is going to find out, now the sender is going to find out that three times of same duplicate acknowledgement 1 has been received. This indicates that the packet 2 which was being sent, that is after acknowledgement 1, the next serial number is 2. So, packet 2 has been lost. So, now this is going to be sensed by the sense sender and now it is going to retransmit the packet 2 to the receiver. So, this is fast retransmit and fast recovery. So, when there is going to be any packet which is going to be lost, it can be recovered and easily. The congestion can be recovered easily. And also, the lost packet can be retransmitted during the process of sending the data itself. So, this is one of the ways that we can control the congestion control mechanism. Thank you.